Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your June 2018 reading. Uh, you know, we're going to start off with a different spread, but before that, I'd like to say thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Head over to my website, take advantage of the $15 special reading. I will close that in two weeks, okay? Um, all information of how to contact me is below. I have shuffled and prayed over the cards off camera. Let's go ahead and get started. So I'm going to pull four cards. It's an advice spread. It's called Do This, Don't Do This. All right? So the first card is uh, what the situation deals with. The second card is what not to do. Don't do this. And the third card is do this. And this will not resonate with every Capricorn, Sun, Moon, or Rising. If it doesn't resonate, click off. It's okay. And what it leads to. Okay. Bottom of the deck, the Page of Wands. A call to action. This is normally either a younger fire sign, a child. It's, it's, it's always a conditional message. It's got strings tied to this, though. All right, what the situation deals with, the King of Swords. This is typically Aquarius or Libra. It can be Gemini, but typically Aquarius or, or Libra. Uh, what it deals with is the person who is an air sign, who is very um, intellectual, thought-based type of individual. Uh, typically, most times they're a black or white type of person. It is or it isn't with them truthful and they're just they're fair you may feel like they're stern sometimes but they're just you know just all about getting to the bottom of it all right don't do this with this person six of pentacle capricorn don't oh wow i just heard don't bleed the situation don't overpower or don't be the one that's the taker in the situation you know give back give to feed into this situation relationship business partnership don't be a beggar in this situation you know um they may have more to give, whether it's monetary, it's energy, it's love, emotion, whatever. But don't, okay, don't be a blood sucker. I don't, I don't even talk like that. So it's for, that's for somebody that's really specific. Don't just, don't deplete the situation. All right, do this. Seven of one. The, you might have to defend this relationship. Some of you have to defend the relationship. You have to defend the connection. Uh, some of you have to um, stand your ground. There might be other people coming toward the situation. Relationship, business, partnership, friendship. Who want to... They don't come with the... Um, the intent to add to the situation of, of positivity they come to you know tear down they come with their wands drawn so you might have to defend this situation defend the relationship they're outsiders either friends family uh third party situations people you used to have in the situation you might have cut them out you need to stand your ground on that it leads to this the two of swords. Some of you are dealing with a Libra. Um, you're going to have to make a decision. And for some of you dealing with an air sign, it might be vice versa. Don't keep giving. Okay? 
stand your ground, make a decision in regards to this person. Okay, we'll do a five card advice spread. Let's see. You know what? I'm gonna use another deck. All right, five cards of advice for Capricorn. Yeah, some of you dealing with an air sign. Um, stand your ground on that situation. Um, if you feel like you're doing more than uh, the other party, then um, you know you, you're gonna have to defend yourself in, in the you know the relationship as to well, hey, I'm I'm doing more here. Don't don't let anybody take advantage of you, or vice versa. Don't take advantage of someone else, Capricorn. All right, five cards of advice for Capricorn. The first card is you, right where you are. The second card is are you on your correct path? The third card is your main obstacle. The third card is your main obstacle. The fourth card is what's helping you. And how can progress be made here? Bottom of the deck, ten of swords or ten of spades. Depletion, an ending, um, extreme pain. Yeah. All right. Okay. You as you are, the two of hearts, a successful relationship, mutually beneficial relationship, maybe with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Are you on your correct path? Ace of Diamond, this is your energy. This talks about engagement, moving things to the next level, making large purchases. It looks good. Wow. Wow, Capricorn. You, okay. Okay. What is your main obstacle? The four of spades. Um, for some of you, it might be that there was a break or there is a break in communication. There might have been illness. There might have been financial issues. Or the main obstacle needs to be that you need to be, get grounded. You need to meditate, pray. You might be dealing with a Sun, Moon, Rising, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. And what is helping you? The Queen of Hearts. Could be dealing with the Cancer. Or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. It's typically Cancer. What's helping you is this loving, open, or someone who takes on that nature. This loving, open, warm, intuitive, spiritual person. This is typically a woman. Can be a man. Um, who is just willing to help. Selfless love here. That's what's helping you. How can progress be made? King of clubs or king of wands. Take action. Take the lead. This is the alpha male of the zodiac. Um, take the lead. Take a risk. Know what you want and go after it. Yeah. The bottom of the deck, the ten of spades. And your main obstacle, yeah, is you guys took a break because somebody disappointed someone here, but you feel like this is your soulmate. And you're the king of hearts. And you just want to offer love. You want to get back to a loving. Then here's you showing up. King of Diamond. You want to get back to a loving, caring relationship with them. You want you might be getting back to that. You might be on the path back to that. Someone hurt someone here. Someone blindsided someone here. 
could bring you Capricorn or vice versa. There's an offer here. Sometimes it's just the untrustworthy, dishonest person. Yep. And then the seven of hearts there. Unfaithful spouse, broken promises. This could be you, Capricorn. You need to make a decision which way you're going. You could be having a change of journey, of home. You could be coming single, becoming single. You could um, be cutting something out. Could be a Libra. Yeah. Okay, Capricorn. Also, the Nine of Diamond talks about being restless in your current position because you might have a um a really good business opportunity on your brain and we did see the king of wands there or the king of clubs which talks about entrepreneurship so for those who are looking for a word about career we can you know, say that let's pull two cards of advice for capricorn for the month of june 2018 three cards of advice Three cards of advice for the month of June 2018. It looks like a really good month. For some of you dealing with air signs, typically Libra. I don't know. Like, you got to make a decision about that. Um, for those dealing with water or uh, air signs, Gemini, Libra. I mean, Gemini, Aquarius. It, it might be that you guys are reconciling getting back to the love okay seeking and finding yeah adult children and we have that page of wands there like someone said something like a, a, a young adult a child found something out for you and it comes to you with with um, some information family changes someone there could be an addition to the family Capricorn some of you dealing with fire sign too fire sign comes in and gives a message and it just makes you have to think about everything uh, addition to the family, a uh, subtraction from the family. Somebody's moving out, someone's moving in, someone's adopting, someone bought a pet, someone got a new home. Family changes just, it, it really encompasses almost everything. Motivation, you need to have a motivation possibly to move on this new um, business venture or something of that sort. Yeah. The motivation to to go after what it is you want and at the bottom of the deck self-care you know worry about yourself put yourself first um you've been putting everything and everybody else first and you forgot to maintain yourself okay so i hope that this helped my capricorn people out uh, request a personal read and take advantage of the $15 reading. Go over to the website, click on book online, click the drop down menu, thought based approach, find the video readings, and then select the video reading you would like. Okay. Uh, all information is below. Follow me on Instago, Instagram. Choose to fund the page by clicking the GoFundMe link. Okay, so Capricorn, remember when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you guys. Pray for me as well. Take care.